What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Frenchie. I do not want to do a lot of talking in the beginning of this video. I just wanted to quickly hop on and let you guys know that today I will be starting the process of dyeing my hair. As y'all can see, like, the hair needs treatment, especially over here, like, what is going on? And the fall is coming up. I've always wanted to do, like, a cinnamon type of color. I think last year, I did like a little hair dye fail in one of my vlogs because I was trying to get to a certain color and I couldn't get to it so I just ended up going back to dark hair but it's a new year and I want to try it again. So I'm going to make this a separate video just focusing on the hair. I didn't really want to put this in a vlog. I was like why not make this my own video okay so that's what we will be doing today we will be dying this hair i hope you guys enjoy it watch me make this either a success or a fail we don't really know but we're gonna find out together okay before we get started with today's video if you have not subscribed to your girl's channel make sure you click that subscribe button i feel like i've been talking enough so let's go ahead and jump right into the video okay so as y'all can see this is my hair right now it's definitely losing some of its you know shape it's losing the curl pattern it's just getting real frizzy and out of control okay but i already have some bleaching kits i got these from target i think they're like seven or eight dollars a piece and i got three of these it tells you on the box depending on the length of your hair how many boxes that you'll need most of the time with like box dyes and stuff i usually just use two boxes but since we are bleaching i figured i might need an extra box so what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to comb my hair out really quickly because it needs to be detangled. Make sure you are dyeing or bleaching your hair on detangled, semi-dry hair. Don't do it on soaking wet hair. So yeah, you guys, I'm gonna pop back on the camera after my hair is detangled. Okay, you guys, so I have my hair all detangled. This side dried a little bit faster, so this is why this is looking a little flat. I'm gonna go ahead and start applying the bleach. It comes with a bottle of ammonia and then two packets of bleach. They're labeled, so the packets are labeled number one and then the ammonia is labeled bottle two. You're gonna take both of those packets, open them and pour them into bottle two and shake it on up. And I'm gonna section off my hair and then we'll get started. Um, once I get started, I know I can't really touch the camera. So I'm gonna just record either until my battery runs out or until I run out of space. have this one last piece to finish bleaching. I'm gonna come back on the camera once everything is applied and it's ready to be rinsed out so you guys can see how much it lightened my hair. I'm not gonna come back when I have to do the roots just because I feel like it's just me putting bleach on my roots. It's gonna take up more time and I only have 32 minutes of space left to film. So I'm gonna finish this, let it all sit, do what I gotta do and I'm gonna come back on camera with y'all once she is all bleached. Okay, you guys, so this is the next day. This is kind of what my hair is looking like after the bleaching kit that I got from Target. Now, I'm not mad at this color. As you can see, there are certain parts where it's a little bit lighter, um, but that just means that the box dye that I had on my hair before I bleached it, the ends kind of washed away a little quicker, but I don't really care about that. Honestly, y'all, I'm not really mad at this color. This is kind of the color that I was going for. I just don't want it to be too red. I've already done red hair. I don't want to go back to that. So we're going to be dyeing our hair again, but with the Adore dye, only because with the bleach, y'all know when you have dyed hair and your hair starts to grow out, your ends typically are more dyed and your roots is like virgin hair. So obviously when I bleached my hair, as y'all can see, like we got some hot roots going. So that is why I will be dyeing my hair again just so we can get it all 
an even color, okay? But y'all, I'm really not mad at this color. Like, I'm kind of feeling it. It's growing on me for sure. So what I have to kind of help even out the color is the Adore dye, and I got Cajun Spice. And then the other one I got is Cinnamon. Now I got uh, two bottles of cinnamon and one bottle of Cajun Spice just so I can kind of have that little bit of a mixture. Um, like I said, I don't want to go bright, bright orange and I feel like with Cajun Spice alone, it'll be a little bit too orange. So I got, you know, more so cinnamon and then just a dash of Cajun Spice to help give that color. And we're about to just yellow it and put this on my hair. My concern is um, I'm going to be a little bit messy with this. <laughs> I have dye stains on the floor from a previous dye job I did a few months back and I just don't want to make too much of a mess but y'all we're about to go in and do it okay so I did about five full squirts of the cinnamon and then we're gonna do maybe three squirts of uh, Cajun spice so yeah as y'all can see the roots are a no but I mean the rest of the hair is pretty it's just I just kind of want to tone it down a little bit, you know, and obviously make it one even color. I'm just going to start applying this to my hair once I've mixed everything in. I'm just going to apply it all over my hair and then I will come back and show you guys the uh, finished product just because I only have 27 minutes left of filming space. So whatever this allows me to film, I will film and then I'll come back and show you guys the rest. <laughs> you guys so the back is applied I have to work on the front which I'm about to do now but I only have six minutes left of footage on this camera so I'm gonna go ahead and just knock these out and I'll come back when I'm done all right you guys so these are the final results of my hair this is how everything turned out I love it at first I was a bit afraid because I thought it was giving like red but I used to do like red red hair like red velvet type of red but this is definitely not giving that it's giving the exact color that i wanted more so cinnamon with a little bit of a spice in there which is literally the names of the dye that i used so i think i'm gonna post the pictures of everything that i used so you guys can see and i'll also have it linked down below So that's all that I have for you in today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I literally have like three minutes left of footage on this SD card. So I wanted to save the last few minutes that I had to show you guys my results. I'm very, very happy with it. And I think I'm gonna keep my hair like this for a while. If you wanna go ahead and give it a try, let me know how it turned out for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Before you head out, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I love you all so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, babes.